In this quick tip, we're going to be taking a look at how to use sketch trimming in Fusion 360. Hey everyone, this is Matt with Learn Everything About Design, and today we're going to take a look at our selection tools and how they work with our sketch trim. Now, I want to note that we've got three different types of selection tools, window selection, freeform selection, and paint selection. Now pay close attention to this selection because as soon as we enable the trim tool, it's going to default to our paint selection. And what this means is if we hold down the left mouse button, we can begin dragging over our sketch entities. Now you will note that in some cases, this will delete things like constraints and dimensions because we're changing the effective length of our designs. For example, this was originally at the midpoint of a line and now we removed half of it. But in some cases, for example here, we're able to quickly remove sections of our sketch and it is able to reconnect those collinear or coincident relationships. You have to be careful when you're using this, but it is a much quicker way to trim when working in Fusion 360.